Hey there, it's salad day at Nanook Lodge, and today we're gonna to make one of my favorites. I call it Midwest Cucumber Salad. Growing up in Minnesota, I spent high school, college, and lots of my young adult life in, in Minnesota, and every time you went to a family reunion or a church picnic or a friend's picnic, uh, somebody brought out the creamy cucumber salad. And so that's what we're gonna to make today. There are so many variations of this. I'm gonna show you what I make, um, but it's a very simple salad made with a dressing of mayo, sour cream, and red wine vinegar. You could use cider vinegar if you wanted to. Um, then we're gonna season it with a little bit of fresh ground pepper. We're gonna use salt, a little bit of sugar, and uh, granulated garlic or garlic powder. Now, you could use minced garlic if you wanted to. It just will make the salad have a little bit more garlicky flavor. This mellows the garlic just a little bit, but brings that hint to it. The two vegetables are really simply cucumbers and a red onion. Uh, I use red onion because I love the different contrast of colors, but if you don't have a red onion, use a white onion or a yellow onion. That's just fine. No, no problem. This salad is creamy and tangy and crunchy. Um, it's, it's great, and it just has so many fond memories for me. All right, we're going to prep up the onions and the cucumbers for this dish. You can see I've peeled the cucumbers. Not all the way, but I've taken most of the peel off. You don't have to. I just like to peel the cucumbers because I think they're a little bit more tender for the salad. And then you're simply just going to slice these into about quarter inch slices. And let's cut up the other cucumber. Cut my onion, I've peeled it, place it down upside down, and then simply just cut thin little slivers of onion. You get to where you can't hold it anymore, just flip it over on its other thick side and continue to cut it. There you go. Here we go. Nice yummy bowl of Midwest cucumber salad. A little bit of onion, a little cucumber, lots of crunch, lots of creaminess. Travels really well. Keep it cold so it's nice and crisp and crunchy until you're ready to eat it. But boy, great memories of growing up when I eat this salad. Enjoy and thanks for tuning in to Cooking at Nana Lodge.